Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Phantom Abyss Daily. Let's quickly grab <coughs> our usual... You know what? No. I'm going to dedicate this episode to a fellow YouTuber named Blen. I think I already did a single single attempt video uh, for him. But the thing is, he gets motion sickness very easily. So for that reason, he uses, where's that one, uh, that whip? This one. The one that makes you immune to fall damage. Uh, because he gets motion sickness every time the guy rolls. I also discovered something. Oh, let me, let me just start first. So let's check out the daily first. Okay, so we're checking the daily. 18% 18 uh, clearance rate. Uh, young page at the top. Holodeck is way down today. And Swordman, 13. Pretty high up also. Let's see the time. Igly with a four and a half minutes. And Ga Gatham with a close one. Anyone else? Holodeck is barely on there. I doubt I'm going to make that score today. Uh, or, or the time. I might make the score, but not the time. Let's see. We'll give it a, a go today. And as I said, I dedicated this first run to blend and see how I do with the no fall damage. <laughs> so we got a caves, an inferno and ending in ruins. Shouldn't be though too difficult. I don't know why the clear rate is so low, but we'll see. Perhaps it is. Um, let's run. Okay, so if I play like Blaine, uh, I get one attempt <laughs> with this, and he plays extremely careful and extremely slow. As you can see, there's one of the settings that I want to show Blaine. I don't know if he just played a long time ago, the last time, but there's now. A setting in video to remove the camera bob and the landing rotation cam which should negate his uh, motion sickness to make it easier for him so we'll see if he noticed this let's just run quickly over yeah i'm gonna collect that little essence might as well evil aku got a quick little jump over here I oh, see that's something. Oh, wrong, wrong side. Again. I keep whipping it on the wrong place. Ooh, immune to fall damage. I forgot. I forgot that I was immune to that. Okay, so there's no. That little lip is just cosmetic. So there's actually no way to make it up there. An extreme function, extreme unction is also. Realizing that just now. I needed the, the high jump to reach that. So this one should be pretty easy. I just make sure I don't mess it up. That one is also low, so I'm gonna go for a jump like that. And then I will go this side. Should be pretty safe for now. Uh, there is something up at Top. So I will go for that little chest. First area, there's no guardian chasing me, even though I do have more difficult guardians with this whip. But also, I don't have the problem of taking fall damage now, so I can just do stuff like this. It is. Even some essences down here. And another chest. Although I do hate going up again so where's the, the middle probably on that beam got larry down there he's almost done rhc is also almost dead there we go exit so this one is the caverns right let's have to remember where where exactly i am I'm doing the double lane tactic again also and removing all these guys. No use taking any risks. 
get rid of these spikes. There we go. Do you see that platform up there? And I should be able to reach it from this thing. You see it. Yeah, there's a secret bio back back there. I just saw the little trail coming from there. There's a lot of high platforms in this. Oh wait, that that side should be much more approachable. If I can actually whip it. Nope. Whipping really bad right now. And I am enjoying the no fall damage, I have to say. Otherwise, I would have been dead long ago. This one is open, but strangely, the previous area's one it wasn't open. Okay, so let's take the slow route back. No, nope. please, thank you. Uh, this should be pretty easy to get through these guys, so. Uh, nice. Mm. Get rid of you. Oh, I don't know why that missed though. It was pretty good targeting. If I do say so myself. Get rid of that thing also. Got Fury Sea Dragon there. He plays pretty slow most of the time. And he's always at the top of the score, so he's got some sort of tactic that I still have to discover. He must go for every single chest in the level. Ooh, ooh, that was almost very bad. So, uh, is there something down there? I will check it out quickly. Oh, it was the key. Okay, well, that's fine then. Then there is something up there also. You go away. You respawned way too quickly. All of these rooms are so tall though. Ah, oh, nice. Finally actually made that one. Ooh, and almost exploded there. Took that long in that room. That was me. Came back twice. No secrets in this room, right? No. None that I know of. Okay, so here can be a lot of secrets. Not this side. This side? Maybe. Okay, I'll check the back side also. Let me just check nothing, right? Yeah. Okay, so let's just get rid of this. Let's do a little Ooh, jump. Oh, that was bad damage, and that was my first damage. Okay, so is there a secret here? No, nothing. And also, not on this side, so it's... Ah, there we go. Damn it. My whoops are really bad today. Okay, this one, I know there's a secret right there. So when it's the ledge going up, then you know there's another secret there. Uh, blessings are cheaper, it's pretty good. Uh, healing also, uh, for the next area, might be nice. Um, but the blessings being cheaper just seems pretty good. I already have 550 coins, so. And I should probably be by the end, of, yeah, by the end of the level right now. So. I can buy quite a few upgrades. So, mm, I'm gonna take the harvest light, even though I never use it. I'm not, not gonna waste on a single heal. Lung whip or lucky? Let's take Lucky, just because, as I said, I'm going to save, save right now. And double jump, definitely. <coughs> I need a easier way to get up those tall rooms. So I believe the next amount I need is 190 or 230 or something like that. The next blessing. So I should get it in this next area. Although Inferno, you... You lose a lot of health very quickly in Inferno. I hope you get more shrines, get that three art up. Or just get rid of... Uh, which one was it? Red God? Which one is in this area? Ooh, 
And I see the lava, healing lava would have been nice. Uh, there's another thing that Blen, I watched Blen's last daily, he did pretty well, but he mentioned that you don't take damage from this lava, only from the ones at the bottom, which is untrue. You do take damage that, uh, from that if you stay in it long enough. <laughs> I found that out the long way, uh, the, the wrong way, not the long way. Um, I think I've died twice from lava like that. So. But it's usually there's a very specific area where that happens. Okay, so I kind of want to... Did I get all of them? Yeah, got all of them. This one should be easy. This one should be easy again. Just scroll below and whoop. Whoop action. And then the backwards whoop. What the heck? That's the first time there's a backwards whoop area with nothing there. Okay, so... Ooh! Almost took lava damage. This is the three... The three chest room, I can already see it. Just by there being a back wall. Oh no, it's green god. Okay, so he can mess me up. Oh, let's go for the score. Now, the safest strategy would have been to take the th two extra hearts, but I am kind of on a money roll now, so let's take that. The safe route also would be just like that, but... Uh, am I safe? I feel pretty safe. There's probably a chest there. Yeah. This area is still safe, so let's go through here. Um, this is safe. And... Here we go. We got a red key. And old stinky god is my way but I'm safe for now yeah, thank you for activating that spikes for me oh there might be something below there but I don't think uh, it appears on the gray statues the secret right oh no that's that bad get away from me stinky let me just make sure yeah now, on the grey statues, I don't believe they appear, but it might just be a wrong assumption I made there. And again, I saw something down there. That's something? I, uh, maybe a reverse? Ooh, that was bad. Ooh, that was bad again. No, this is just a waste of time. Mm. And this? Oh, I got this. It's just uh, n another way to get there. I didn't even notice that. Go for the long jump. Risky. But why not? But one of these, and they're moving simultaneously, which is not ideal. So I will stop this one for now. Quickly go below. Oh, got a little bit of poison, but did not get damage. Um, safe statues. Uh, that's probably the safe thing to choose. Because this guy is already annoying enough without trying to dodge all the, the darts. And now look at that, he's at the bottom. Oh. <laughs> you didn't see that, but I actually ducked my actual IRL head to get below that. <laughs> That's kind of how I play games. Let me see, I've for the first time noticed the secret year uh, when I was doing a challenge run earlier. Oh, okay, so it's not a secret, it's just the other side of that door. At least this is all stinked off now, so... And he spawns right in front of me. I think it's a he or she, what doesn't matter. The green one. Oh, I really dislike this room. Really, really dislike this room. I did it, I did it, I did it, I just made it. Okay, and if you've watched yesterday's episode, you know I really did like this room also. I still wish you could whip the the poison balls away. Did I get that? I got it, yes, and that's an extra life. So now we've got this area, but I think it's the first time I have to I had to go up. Yeah, I've got the 
the anti-darcing, otherwise I would have been dead already. This the room I saw Hollow Decker doing some voodoo shit <laughs> where he jumped below there into that little corner. As in yeah it was a shrine? What kind of voodoo magic is this? <laughs> <laughs> what the heck and it actually works okay, let me get the super jump now might as well is there something this side then why why is there that's a mega secret but how do i get out of here now like that apparently okay so so far this is a really good run even though i'm going at snail space so the the blame strategy is working there is a secret up here and i will do it double jump tiny hop go down again I can pull on take that damage so might have missed uh, something else there but rather not take the chance okay, I got 200 in give me some wings and give me a long whip I've got pretty much most of the, the upgrades I really need to survive uh, I could do with some more help and I really could do with the anti curse thing because this guy is getting way too strong for me. But at the moment, it's not going to happen. <laughs> I can still banish him, though, with the shrine. So is this a four brazier door uh, final room? As this, uh, the last, uh, yeah, yesterday's one was the first time I saw the, the runes with the four brazier. Are we going to get another one, or is it two door? Oh, two brazier. Let's see. It looks like the easy one. Let's go left. That's usually my starter one. I am a little bit afraid of this. And there I managed to avoid the damage. Nice. No, 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 no. I just realized. I've ignored my own strategy. And usually I just go for that chest first. Because it leads you around. <gasps> Ooh. I ducked my head again. <laughs> Is that enough? With the double jump it is. First gloom room. But it is in uh, the ruins. So it shouldn't be dark. Now I know there's a secret up there. You can spit all you want. I'm going to wait for you. Let me just check if there's like a little secret chest over here. Nothing I can see. So I will go back. There we go. Oh, that was bad luck, but okay. No, what's going on? Give me that. Give me this. More. And then let's do this big jump with the wings. I actually forgot I had wings. <laughs> That's the problem I always face. No secret here. Gloom room number two. Uh, wait, Gringo got spawned, but he disappeared almost immediately. Now. There's no other rooms, uh, groom rooms that I know big secrets about. You go away. So I'm kind of want to know where the rest, or if there is any others. There's, there's a hole there, so I can probably go down this. Slowly glide my way down. Oh, well, there's another shrine, but that asshole spawned right in front of me. We'll take the ah there we go goodbye that's the end of you so further on that should be an, a cakewalk but take any more real unnecessary damage then it's all on me up here a nice little side treasure also is that something up there or is that just a void yeah it's a void Don't no more treasure. Room room number three, all in the same side. So this is definitely something. So this one, yeah, the treasure on this side. King Chongus, right up there. Nothing that side. Go see what's up here. Nothing, just the, the head of the statue. Side one, done. 
So far, pretty perfect. Uh, no, let's do my strategy. You go away. Get that. Get this. Then just slowly run around. I can actually just jump over this. Oh, that was a, <laughs> a bit of a problem almost. But, oh, terrible hook there. Nice. Okay, we've got a, a circle room. Is there anything down there? Not by the looks of it, so but let's just take the shortcut anyway. Nice. Hmm. Ooh. Again, took a chance there. That's some erratic movement also again from my mouth, but Okay. Down, doggy, down. Goodbye. Okay, so we have this gloom room once again. Is this the one with a chest in that corner? I believe, yeah. There is some spikes here. Maybe there was in the previous one also, and I just didn't notice it. Yeah, there probably was. Into another gloom room? Maybe? No. I will take the long route again. Ooh, there's a lot of deaths here. You know, I can just shortcut over to that side, but I do want a single... You know what? Let's do this. I do want the single chest here. <laughs> Let's go through the slow, slower side. Uh, please stop, please stop. There we go. Thank you. Nice. This is going... Swimmingly. I have to say, the plane special uh, is working like 100%. Let's, you know what? I might as well go for this. Even though I'm wasting time, I already took 20 minutes. Why not? Let's go for everything. Whoop again, sure. Give me every single upgrade. Whoop out. Whoop out. And there's some chest here also, but I, as I said, I'm already screwed on time, so might as well go the long way. And collect. Oop, oop. That's again my erratic behavior. Okay, so usually there's one here, isn't there? Or is it still on? Ah, oh, it's that old. Ooh, what the hell happened there? Got this big gap. There's another one there. Open this. Go all the way around. And I'm supposed to go up here. Am I supposed to hit something there? I don't think so. But I am supposed to hit this. Open that side door. And get the last chest. This little one. Perfect. Nice. Plain special done. Look at all those upgrades I have at the bottom. The blessings. And I got rid of uh, a green god. Five hearts to spare. I think I got hit once. Unfortunately, otherwise it would have been pretty perfect. But I think it should be a really good score even, even after that, so... I mean, I mean, the current score that I have already is probably in the top 10. That's without having to finish the dungeon. The time, unfortunately, <laughs> is a disgrace, but we don't mention that. Duplicate, yeah, that's fine. Ooh, that's really, really close. Two second. But I did beat quite a few guys in score so this is the second time in a row I'm, I'm third in score my time i don't even have to look but let's see maybe about 15th 16th 25th <laughs> that's hilarious well 
I was gonna do a couple of runs, but this one was so successful. Uh, I think any other run is gonna spoil it. So <laughs> I'm just gonna end it up here. Um, as I said, this is the Blaine special. Go check him out. I'm gonna leave his link also at the bottom. He does uh, daily runs also, and he does it one single attempt. If he screws up, he stops the recording. So I did his challenge, and I did it the blend style with the same type of whip. And I also showed him the instructions where you can go to the options, video, and at the bottom you can turn off the bob and the rolling for all your other motion sickness people. Anyway, that has been, as I said, a really good run. Uh, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video or my content, please leave a like and subscribe in comment. Just let me know that you like it. And uh, I'll see you guys again in tomorrow's daily. Uh, goodbye.